and fallout from a school project. Angry messages and online outrage after an assignment written by a student appears to glorify Hitler. Thanks for being with us. I'm Adam Cooperstein, and let's begin with that controversial assignment that we first told you about last night here on News 4 at 11. Because tonight, there are growing concerns fueled by a flurry of online posts and angry phone calls, and it's gotten so big, the mayor is now taking a stand. Investigative reporter Sarah Wallace joins us now from Tenafly with more reaction to this. Sarah. Well, Adam, you know, this thing has just exploded on social media. I started getting contacted over the weekend. So did the mayor. He said the most painful phone call he received was from a Holocaust survivor. Dismissal time at Mom Elementary School this afternoon. The principal and parents not talking to reporters. But on social media, it seems everyone has an opinion about a fifth grade student's project. The 11 year old's choice for an historical figure, Adolf Hitler. The assignment to dress as the character and list accomplishments in the first person. She wrote, I was pretty great, wasn't I? And then, my belief in anti Semitism drove me to kill more than six million Jews. How are we going to make sure it doesn't happen again? Doran Moreski heads up a community organization, the Anti-Semitism Watch. It's not even a, a First Amendment freedom of speech issue. There is no world in which this should have happened in the first place. We've now learned the report was posted with others for several days in the hallway during April. The Board of Education now investigating who knew what and when they knew it. Last night, under heavy pressure, the superintendent issued an updated statement saying, in part, we are committed, as always, to cultivating a positive school culture that has no room for hate, prejudice, bias, or oppression. Tenafly's mayor. We can't pretend that these words, which were extremely hurtful and misguided, uh, and, and the the adults allowed to take place. We can't let that be buried. We can't cover it up. We have to talk about it. Now, just in the last few minutes, the Board of Education put out a new statement. It said that the student's assignment has been taken out of context, causing understandable anger and concern. They added that the whole idea was to highlight issues of social justice, both good and evil, and that it is unfair to criticize either a student or a teacher. They say in this case, the teacher is Jewish. Live from Tenafly, Sarah Wallace, News 4 New York.